Hey guys, what's up? Ashley here. It's day number 214 of daily vlogging. Today is August 6th. It's Friday. <laughs> Happy Friday. <Yay! laughs> Happy birthday to Miss Lisa. And like, uh, how the heck is it August, guys? <laughs> like, when did this happen? I don't understand. I don't understand. Um... So anyway, <laughs> what will we talk about today is the question. <laughs> um, so what I do want to talk about today is that if you know anything about Disney World, Walt Disney World, um, you know that October 1st is the anniversary of the Magic Kingdom and Disney World proper like the whole thing so magic kingdom was first so obviously um so it's the 50th anniversary on october 1st and um to draw crowds away <laughs> from magic kingdom uh they disney world decided to open remy's ratatouille adventure i think that's the official name of it the ride at epcot in the france pavilion um they decided to open that on october 1st and also, they decided to start Harmonious on October 1st. Um, so, those things are kind of put in place to take the crowds away from Magic Kingdom. And, um, I mean, I wasn't able to get a park reservation pass for Magic Kingdom. Um, and I got one for Epcot before they announced that all this stuff. Um, but anyway, so, the point is, is that there's a new ride coming to Epcot. Remy's Ratatouille Adventure and it's starting it's opening grand opening on October 1st so what they decided to do was one they're having I'm pretty sure they're having cast member previews and um, DVC previews and annual pass holder previews and we got a notification I don't remember if it was like an email or if there was just like articles about it that there was going to be an uh, annual pass holder preview in September and I was like, oh, I wonder when that's going to be. I hope that I'm, <laughs> I hope that I can make it. Um, so, but no one knew when you would be able to sign up for these pass holder previews. So I happened to be looking at my phone this morning and the little icon, the little Disney World icon popped up, right? <laughs> so um, I was like, oh, I wonder what that is. Usually it's like, they gave you some sort of new picture or something or like your reservation time is coming up. I don't know. Like they have all kinds of silly things that pop up when you're not like actually there. So I don't know why. And normally I just like let it let the notification sit there and I don't look at it at all. I don't know why <laughs> I decided to open it, but I did. And it said, uh, reserve your time now for Remy. So I so I hit it. And it brought me to the website and it said, your wait is five minutes. So I waited my five minutes and then I looked at the calendar and I was like, oh, great. So I am going to be there the whole week leading up to the 50th. I'm not saying much after it because O-Town. <laughs> I say that like it's a bad thing. But yeah, so I'm leaving on October 2nd, but I'll be there the whole week in front of the 50th. Um... So I picked one of those days in the last week of September and I got a time and I was so excited and I was like, wow, this is really cool. Even though like I've already been on this ride because I went on it in Disney World, not Disney World, Disneyland Paris. Um, I don't really remember it too well. I mean, I remember it being really cute and I enjoyed myself on it and I know that we waited a really long time for it because the day that we went to Disneyland, it was very, very crowded. Um, I don't know why it was so crowded, but it was. We only went on, we didn't go on a lot of things. We went on Remy's, we went on Crush, the Crush Coaster, which I would be so happy if that one came to Disney World. Um, we went on their Big Thunder, which we waited like three hours for. Um, and I feel like that's it. I feel like those are the only things we did. Um... We might have gone on Rock and Roller Coaster. I don't really remember. I think we did. I think we went on Rock and Roller Coaster. Um, it's slightly different if I'm remembering correctly. So yeah, we did like four rides. That was it. Um, 
but yeah, so I've been on Remy's. So it's like, it's exciting, but it's also like, I think I would be more excited if it was like the Guardians of the Galaxy Rewind coaster. That would, when that one comes out, I'll be super, super excited. But anyway, I was very, very, I'm, I'm very excited and I'm very grateful that I have the opportunity to go on it before it opens to the public. Um, but also, I was in a Facebook group after that and I saw people like had wait times of like hours and I was like, oh my gosh. I was like, I felt so lucky that. I only had a wait time of five minutes. Like that was so clutch that I happened to be looking at my phone when the notification popped up. Like, wow, good job, me. <laughs> um, <laughs> so yeah, so that's exciting. Um, I don't really have anything else to talk about today. Oh, this is a new Disney World shirt that I got the last time I was there. So it has my girl Daisy Duck on it and the castle. Um, so I really like this shirt. It was so cute when I saw it. I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have it. <laughs> Do you guys think that I'm more of a Minnie Mouse or a Daisy Duck? Um, my mom thinks that I'm like a mix of both. And I kind of agree. <laughs> um... So yeah, I'm very excited. If anyone else is an annual pass holder and is also going to be um, previewing Remy's on the 27th at 6 p.m., <laughs> let me know. <laughs> I did the 6 to 7 slot because I haven't decided which days I'm working and which days I'm not working. So I figured if I did 6 to 7, if I work during the day, I can still get there in time. Right? Right. <laughs> so, <laughs> um... Yeah, I think that's it for me for today, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. I love you. Bye.